What's going on everybody? I'm Vanar Vapor and welcome to today's video. Today we're going to be playing some Hellblade Senua's Sacrifice. Uh, last time we did a couple puzzles. Before that we did some more puzzles and before that was more puzzles. Um, yesterday we did the super creepy scary darkness puzzle that scared the shit out of me. We did the mask puzzle. Um, I think we did another puzzle, but I don't remember what it was. So today we're going to probably do some more puzzles. <laughs> and we'll see how that goes. Um, yeah, there's a lot of puzzles right now. No sword means no fighting, right? So I figured they might just, like, throw some shit at me. You know, to, like, kind of hit you with a curveball. You don't got a sword here, try and fight. But no, they're just completely avoiding fighting altogether since I have no way to defend myself. Uh, be sure to check out my other social media, Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, YouTube, and Flare. Links are in the description below. If you enjoy what you see, please like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell. It is very much appreciated, and let me say in advance, welcome to the Vidarmy. I would love it if you guys could subscribe to my YouTube channel. I am currently striving for 100 subscribers to set a custom URL for YouTube. I have a bunch of content already uploaded and scheduled to release as of right now daily at 12 p.m. EST. Okay, let's get right into this game. Voices fucking trip me out so hard. Be right back. I just gotta potty real quick. Okay, let's get back into this. You guys ready? That was the, the one I was dreading. <gasps> Excuse me. <gasps> the first one I did and this next one I'm gonna do aren't that bad. really really don't like that darkness one specifically because of like that's why I don't really like the darkness it's not that I'm afraid of the dark I'm afraid of what you can't see in the dark you know what I mean so that's what it comes down to is I, I thought I did that one already is um it fucks me over and that's exactly how they portray it too is it's not the darkness that's scary it's what you can't see in there forced the dwarves to make a sword that would never fail and never rust and that would slice through iron and stone and bring victory to its bearer but the angry dwarves cursed it it would be the death of a man every time it was drawn and it would be the death of the king let me tell you about the sword Tierby. okay So 
is strange that we go to such lengths to bury death. Something so very ordinary. Inevitable. I don't think I got this one. It's as if we conspired to hide death. Because we have no answer for it. But when it comes. Nope. And it forces itself onto our friends or loved ones. I really should let them finish talking yeah. before. Herver demands her inheritance. Herver ignores her father's warnings. The grave mound opens, and it seems to be full of fire. Again, Herver demands her inheritance. But her father warns her the sword is cursed and would be the bane of her family. But he relents and brings her the sword. She leaves the island with it. The curse true. And death would follow in the years to come. And so, Senua, the misdeeds of a father have cursed his life. Six more. Hopefully there weren't any in that dark area. Cause there's no way I was going to look for them. Absolutely none. I haven't found a face in a while. I wonder how many faces there are too. Can I not light this? Oh, I can. Oh, I did find this one last time. I'm surprised. Senua, you remind me of a story that the Northmen tell about a young woman warrior. Her name is Herva, the daughter of a berserker born after he was killed. She's a wild, willful child who teaches herself to fight with weapons. When she learns where her father is buried, her only desire is to reclaim the treasure buried with him, but above all, the sword, Tyrvin. I'm supposed to follow like his calls. <clears throat> so if I found that, then I probably went back the other way. I didn't go this way. So I'm gonna go this way and see if I can find another rune tablet. Tablet here. I wish it would run. I 
And that's where I came in. That was to the rune tablet, and then this is the right way. place by day than other places are by night. Fearless, she lands alone. There are many grave mines, and all of them have ghostly flames burning over them. She comes to the grave mound of her father after passing through these ghostly fires as though they were mist. The flames I have passed through will be enough down the bottom of the hell. Truth was burnt to death. So if I found that, did I go this way? Last time? Oh, it's like a labyrinth. Okay, that leads there. And then I went that way. Let's go this way. I like this? No. So I lit that torch and that torch lit. That means it's the same room. Okay, that's obviously the right way. I can really hear his voice. So it's gotta be the right way. So let's go this way first. So I lit there and I lit that, so that's gotta be the way to go. So let's go. Fuck, I don't know which way I should go. One way is obviously the right way, and then one way is the wrong way. I'd like to go the wrong way first to find everything. So that's a dead end. I have that. Within the burial. 
Erver calls on her father to wake from death and bring her his soul. She says that it is not seemly for the dead in their grave mounds to bear valuable weapons. Her father answers with words of You go to your doom. Baleful runes surround you. You have gone mad. You have lost your mind. Your thoughts are confused. It is dangerous to wake the dead. Like I said, she reminds me of you. So I guess I found all the ones in here last time. side of this grate now. That voice. It's not Dilly. <coughs> Scoozy. That one's already lit. So it's got to be this way. It's already went the other way. Your face. Did you hear that? Let me know if you guys see a face. Anytime it goes Senua, usually means there's a face near me. I don't want to go in there yet. ground maybe go that way and miss it.
four. If only we could see life through each other's eyes, there would be no hatred. And we only hate what we fear. We only fear what we cannot see. Your father. And I will keep on trying, but his gods will not let him avert his gaze. But if he could, he would know not to turn his anger on us. Facebook. Okay, we got the face. See the darkness in your eyes, child. I'm not a boy. Boy. Jesus. No. He said he could help me. It's a trick. He said I could be normal. Normal? Yes. No boy is going to save you. No uh -oh. one can. When they see the rot growing no. inside you, no. they will turn their back on you. The gods can only fix you through my hand. You're going nowhere. Because he lost his wife, doesn't want to lose his daughter, he's trying to keep her close. You will not defy the gods. Mouse beard. Your curse will make everyone suffer. You will have blood on your hands. Ta da! That part's done. Should be all of them. Um, I'm, I think I have the sword now, and then I have two more bosses. The hell! I did all three already. I did that one already. I 
gonna make me fucking do this one again. And I'm gonna be pissed. I saw once a plague strike northern lands of ice. I thought I did this one already. So terrible that not the oldest man among us could remember the like. Hundreds died. The sickness took nearly every person younger than 40 and many older. And where dying mothers gave birth, the marks of the plague were on the babes as they came out of the womb. I thought I did this. I didn't do this, but I thought I had come to this one already. was wrong something sinister she begged them to leave but they just laughed at her but soon enough as the bodies piled up no one was laughing and they knew that she was not like that Sorry, don't cry. the world needs people like us because we reveal the secrets that they are blind to Sometimes when we dream of the coming storm, they may think we've brought the storm with us. What they say about me is not true. They are just scared. You must forgive them. You must forgive them. to view that at the right angle. This game is amazing, dude. This is my second playthrough. It's definitely worth getting, dude, I promise. You see the death because there will be death in the house. 
graphics are amazing. Okay, what's different? Missed one of the faces, I think. Missed one of the faces, and I still have five of these runes. Wait, six of these runes to find. I want to check back in here real quick. Make sure I didn't miss one of the rooms while rushing through. <clears throat> I'm at probably about halfway through the game right now. Maybe a little more. Nothing over here. General, come to me. Where are you? Oh no. I'm right here. Are you in there? This part is really fucking hard. Called Gretty. Big, red haired, immensely strong. But he was afraid of the dark. It happened one night that an undead creature came to his house to drag him outside into darkness and kill him. He resisted with every ounce of his strength. He clung to the door frame, but it gave way, and they spilled out of the house, and the monster fell back, and the moon shone down on its ghastly face. Gretir, terrified, cuts off his head, but is cursed forever. From that moment on, wherever he was, he would see those hideous eyes staring back at him. Sometimes, we allow our own fear to haunt us to our fear. You guys ready to see me die a bunch of times? Okay, here I go.
Fuck, fuck, fuck. Fuck, 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 balls! Go, 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 go! No, it's very different. Definitely a fucking it's like a psych psychological horror. You play a, a woman named Senua. She was a Pict, Senua. and when the Vikings came to her village, Senua. she got psychosis. What happened? The facial expressions are so good. They say that I'm cursed. What if they're right? How would they know such a thing? Are they gods? None of us are. They're just... people. Good people, but... they're scared. They're afraid of what they can't see. The children scared of the dark. They make up stories to fill the void. What if my father was right? You have to step out of this darkness. Let me see who you really are like I am. I'm not a monster. Thanks for stopping in, everyone. I really appreciate each and every one of you. Be sure to check out my social media, Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, YouTube. Um, I appreciate all of the, my subscribers and all the comments. I read them every day. Uh, you guys make this worthwhile. You are the stars of this show. Not sure what time it is for you, so good morning, good afternoon, good evening, and good night. Much love, and march on, Vid Army.